Hey, maybe this time we'll play as someone we actually care about. After another one of these long, drawn out chat room scenes. Ugh. Uh, is there something around here I can read while... You know what, I'll be right back. Okay. Stephen King's It. Now here he was, chasing his boat down the left side of Witcham Street. He was running fast, but the water was running faster, and his boat was pulling ahead. He heard a deepening roar and saw that fifty yards further down the hill, the water in the gutter was cascading into a storm drain that was still open. And by the way, have you ever seen anyone named Mimi that wasn't a bitch? Digimon, the Drew Carey Show, I'm just saying. It was a long, dark semicircle cut into the curbing, and as George watched, a stripped branch, its bark as dark and glistening as seal skin, shot into the storm drain's maw. It hung up there for a moment and then slipped down inside. That was where his boat was headed. Ah, oh, crap, the game's gonna start. Let me just bookmark this. <coughs> Oh my god, it's the hospital level from Juon. God, why does everything remind me of that? <coughs> okay, so someone's in the hospital thinking of that one scene from Heavy Rain. A dream? It's that same dream again. I haven't seen it for a while. In a while. Read the script. Um, school? Why am I... Ah, uh, yes. Why does everything have to involve a school in games like this? Wait, is that... Is that a watermark, or... You know what? Hudson logic. I'm not going to question it. Wait a minute. Hold on. I think I can do this. I'm not leaving until I do. Oh, I'm so close. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Dun 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 I can feel it coming in the air tonight Oh Lord Ah, that's the most fun I've had in the game so far That's really sad <coughs> Moving on Come children And hear the story of El Vaquero. Maybe some other time. Right now I have to play Calling. <laughs> and I cannot observe any of this. Not that I could, because it's probably going to tell me it's too dark. And if it does tell me that, I'm... <laughs> Damn it! I realize there's no brightness setting in real life, but this is still stupid. I'm debating whether I'm actually hitting A on these musical instruments, because I think it'll actually do something worthwhile. Or because I'm just killing time so I don't have to focus on the actual game. I get. Wait a minute. Anyway, can I do Lord of the Rings on this thing? 
da 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 dun 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 Ah, uh, whatever. Uh, darkness again. <clears throat> Let's just get out of here. <clears throat> Wait, can I, can I go through this door? Uh, no, of course not. No particular reason we can't go through the door, we just can't. <gasps> and just when this game couldn't get more annoying, they put in Pac Bell's cannon as a ringtone. Oh, God. I had so many friends in high school orchestra who were tortured by this song. Mostly cello players. Because they were the ones who just had to sit there and repeat da, 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 over and over and over. Look up Pac Bell's rant on YouTube if you haven't already. You'll see what I mean. Make it stop. Finally. No, 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 no! That's my phone. I'm at the exit. I'm coming to get it back. Okay? It's your phone! Getting it back! Okay! Seriously, why is an old lady leaving her phone on the fourth floor of a school? And wait, how is she calling my phone if... Uh, Hudson Logic. Ghost did it. Whatever. Now, if she's at the exit, do I have to... Am I gonna, like, meet her halfway or something? Am I even supposed to give it back? Is it a ghost who's just gonna kill me? Well, I'm gonna save just in case. And I'm actually gonna power it off because I need to get to sleep. So here's something that I just noticed. I got an email, or we mail from Hudson. You know, this would be really creepy if it didn't look like uh, the emo Japanese version of me didn't just get drunk, shove the cat on his head, and pass out. I see what you're going for here, it's just... Uh, T-rated horror games. It's not to say that a T-rated horror game can't be scary, it's just that most people who do them aren't creative enough to be able to make it work. And by the way, it clearly says Hudson underneath it, so you're kind of blowing your suspense, Hudson. Oh well, back to the game. Good for you. I'm sure your mother's very proud. Oh, something is... <sighs> yeah, you wake up in the middle of the school when you don't remember being there. A strange person starts calling you on a cell phone that isn't yours. Just a little strange. I'm at the staircase landing on the second floor. Nice, I'm pretty sure there's an achievement for that if this was on the 360 or something. Whatever. Where the hell am I supposed to go? You know, I should do the world a favor by breaking this phone in half, but I'm gonna answer it. I'm at the staircase landing on the third floor. Am I supposed to move away from the landing, or...? <sighs> unnecessary dialogue. Completely unnecessary. Now, we're on the fourth floor. I have no idea where the staircase landing is, so I don't know where exactly I should go. Okay, this looks important. And it's not moving. Great. Well, back to square one.
Assuming I can find square one. Uh, what am I doing? Okay, so there is a map. I completely forgot about that. Okay, so am I... I'm assuming I'm the blinking dot? Or am I the weird blue smudge? I can't really tell. I'll, I'll just move a little bit. Okay, let's see where the dots are now. Okay, so I am the blinking dot. Wait, then what's, what's the smudge? Damn it, I turned myself around. Oh well, I'm already going this way. Uh, this is gonna take a while, isn't it? Largely because I have no idea where to go or what to do. Okay, I'm still- it's gotta be something with these doors. It has to be, because that's the only thing that I could look through the glass. That was it. Uh, this is like the old DOS adventure games. You miss one little thing and you're completely lost. Oh yay, jump scare. Now we're gonna go into yeah, caution mode. Okay, most obvious one, just gonna look behind me, nothing there, so I'll continue spinning in a circle. Oh, she's gonna eat me! Ah! 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 Oh, fat chicks. Why did it have to be fat chicks? Oh, oh, don't, no, no! I am not a cupcake! I guess I have to move, but where? I guess maybe a staircase? Where are the staircases? Well, according to this, there's one up ahead. So if I can just get there... It... I'm kind of being overdramatic about these things because if you just shake the Wiimote and hit A, you don't lose health. You'll notice that my horror meter thing has not changed, and I've encountered ghosts like three different times. Okay, make a left, go all the way to the end, and then do a U-turn to the right. And by the way, I'm running automatically now, not holding the Z button. I guess that just happens for sequences like this. Oh. Wait a minute. Aw, oh, crap. I'm back here. No, no. No. No, dinner is in half an hour. I'm getting a text in the middle of a chase scene? Okay, so I guess I am supposed to go to no! No! I will beat you with a wooden spoon. Go away! <coughs> oh, there it is. Now very calmly walk down the stairs. You don't want to trip and fall like a white girl in a horror movie. <laughs> 